that's a lot of color. Now it's gone. It'll come back on though. Um, I am, this morning, I decided that I just want a Starbucks this morning. It's not even Friday. Ooh, shame on me. But um, anyway, so if I get one today, I'll probably skip Friday because it's only like once a week that I really need it. And it's only, it's like, ooh, so I shouldn't get it twice a week because it's so bad. It's so bad. But so was it Monday night? Yeah, Monday night I walked a mile and a half, which is good, like a really heavy, brisk mile and a half, red lights. And um, I still look awful. I still look like... Like, I don't know, like a dark circle or something. And I really don't have dark circles. But bizarre. Anyway, so I walked a mile and a half Monday night. And then last night we didn't we didn't walk last night. Um, I guess because we knew that it was going to rain. But it never, ever rained. So that kind of sucked. But today it's raining. Because it's 723. And it's so cloudy and so dark outside. Ugh. And I think we're supposed to have a couple days of this. So that sucks. And then Saturday is supposed to be really, really nice for the progressive dinner, which I'm excited about. So, um, yeah, everything is coming along really, really well with that. I made all of the, um, what are they, I'm calling them like a progressive dinner itinerary. So I made all of those last night, or I made them all yesterday. And um, they turned out so good. I put one in everybody's mailbox last night. I was really, really happy the way that they turned out. Um, I, like I said, I made every single one of them. There was only eight of them that I had to make. So I, I had to make eight of them, eight per family or eight per, yeah, eight per family who's coming. So anyway, so yeah. And then I'm getting all of my stuff together for the progressive dinner, which this will post on Friday. And then you guys, tomorrow night is the progressive dinner from Friday. So today's Wednesday. So anyway, uh, and then today at nine o'clock on Wednesday, my um, Christmas home tour um, is uh, is live. It's going to be live at nine o'clock. And if you guys missed it, I will post a link right there. So you guys can go back and watch it or share it with somebody. Or if you missed it, go back and watch it. Um, but yeah, I'm excited about that. I'm excited to share that stuff with you guys. I was like, I wanted it perfectly to be posted like today was Wednesday. And I always try to make sure that I have something up on Monday, Wednesdays, Fridays. And um, it just happened to be that December 2nd fell on a Wednesday, which helps because then that's the day that I could post that. Start off the Christmas season with that. Um, where are we at now? Oh, 16 days from Disney. So excited about that. And, um, yeah, so I'm trying to get everything together. I did order another sweatshirt the other day. Um, another Christmas Disney sweatshirt. Because I, I don't, because I wanted to. <laughs> um, so this one is black with the white snowflake Mickey and then a red, um, bow on the top. So... It's like a snowflake mini, then not Mickey. Um, but my other one is gray with the white and the red bow. So we shall see. I, I don't know what, I don't know. I just wanted two options, I guess. I wanted more options. Because then I have that other Christmas shirt that I have that I'm going to wear. Hold on, i got to order. Thank you for choosing Starbucks from Little Bill. My name is Emily. Uh, can I get a tall white mocha with caramel drizzle, caramel syrup? Yeah, what else for you? That's it. Five minutes, yeah, see you window. Thanks. Thank you. So yeah, I'm only going with a tall today. I don't need a grande. But I'm sure the calorie count isn't any different. From what I've heard, Starbucks kind of does a weird thing with their cups, and it's really like the same size and, or the same amount of drink in every single cup. I don't know. That's just what I've heard. But anyway, yes. So about the sweatshirts. I'm really not sure. Like, I know we're leaving Thursday the 17th, like, after we get off work. So we're going to be driving for a few hours in the dark. But I wanted to, like, get to Disney early on Friday because I obviously I want to walk around um, downtown Disney. I want to see a few things around there. And then we're supposed to have lunch at the new um, Indiana Jones thing there at downtown disney i can never ever remember what it's called but anyway, we're supposed to have lunch not there. taking reservations for this whole thing just makes me look so weird this lighting it's so bizarre 
Why does it make my eyes look so weird? But anyway, so um, they are not taking okay, reservations. Okay, guys. So I asked if you guys wanted me to do vlog days, and two people said yes. <laughs> so, all right. So I'm going to give this a whirl. I did it last year. That's because I stayed at home. I wasn't working, so I was able to vlog and share every single day about things that I did. If I do it um, this year, obviously this is what you guys are going to get. You guys are going to get me in my like work clothes every single day. You're going to get me either on my way to work, on my way home from work, running around on my lunch break, trying to do some Christmas shopping. You're going to probably get what I'm eating for lunch from time to time. You are probably going to see what we have for dinner. And then that's about it. So that is probably what every single day of vlogging will consist of. So if you guys are ready for all that, hang tight because seriously, this life is like so exciting every single day. So Brian and I have actually started a little challenge and he actually forgot his um, orange like sippy cup or orange water bottle today. So I have my, my water bottle and um, we have to drink five or I want to say five plus eight ounces, but yes, five plus eight extra ounces. So that makes sense. Five of those 24 ounce bottles plus an additional eight ounces on top of that to make it 128 ounces to make it one gallon. Whew. So that is what our challenge is. So we are gonna start doing that. I started today because I already had my bottle with me. So we are gonna start doing that and drinking water, more water, because I already drink, I already drink a lot of water, he doesn't, but I don't think that I drink that much water, but I am gonna start drinking. So that was our challenge today, was to start drinking um, five plus an eight ounce bottle of water. So that's what our challenge is gonna do. We're gonna see how, how well that lasts us for this month, because look, 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 it's, it's coming back it's coming back so and oh my god I don't want to be like that heavy again so we got to do something different so right now I'm on my break and um, they're bringing lunch in I think they said Ruby Tuesdays today but I have to run and return oh poop sons of guns I have to return that coat that's back there so that mer that navy blue coat but I forgot to put it in a bag. So I won't be able to return it today because I'm not going to walk in there with just a coat in my hand because that will look pretty silly. I need to have it in a bag. So I'll probably just run into, where should I run into today? I should probably run into, my nose is itching. Probably run into, oh, oh Home Goods really quick. I was going to run into Home Goods really quick and see what they've got. Um, y'all, that's what I'm gonna do. So, if you guys are interested, I'm gonna go to Home Goods. I'll take you. Oh, shoot. Look at the freaking traffic. <sighs> I knew this was a mistake. I'll never get in there. I wonder if people, there's like a secret passageway to get into this place, but there's probably not. Oh my god, this is Atlanta for you, folks. I can't share with you what the traffic looks like right now because I'm stopped by a truck. But yeah, it's like bumper to bumper traffic. There, now you can see. Bumper to bumper traffic. And I have to cross over a bridge and get to like that part of town, which is just like over this bridge. But because the traffic is backed up and everybody wants to turn left at this light up here, I, pr I waited through this light like three times the other day and I'll probably end up waiting longer than that today just so I can go over to home goods yeah we shall see oh god I think the more the closer that it gets to the holidays the worse this is gonna be yeah that's my guess crazy so welcome to vlog a day in traffic try to turn left so as I was thinking um, about things too, I 
I received a gift in mail the other day from a young lady who contacted me saying that she has an extra Erin Condren life planner and if I wanted it that I could have it I was like what no way so I'm gonna share that with you guys later once I get home but besides that she filled it full of a bunch of like stickers and like planner stickers and I was like what oh my god so cool so I'm gonna share all of those with you guys later but my point of this was I actually had to give her my personal address in order to send this, which I was fine because I did that for um, some other lady a couple months back or what a year ago or so who wanted to send me something and I did, which I loved because they're like little Mickey Mouse tins. And thank you because you know who you are. I love them. But anyway, I have been like, since I've had a YouTube channel, I've been like throwing up the idea of getting a P.O. box. Now last Christmas when I was going to think about doing a P.O. box, I only had like 200 subscribers. Um, so that really wasn't like, you know, a lot. And I noticed that a lot of people have P.O. boxes. So I've been like really wanting to do a P.O. box because if I do a P.O. box, and you guys don't have to send me anything at all, but when something like that comes up, like that young lady wanted to send me that stuff a couple weeks ago, or actually last week I got it, um, then I have a P.O. box and it's there and it's available, so if you guys ever wanted to do something like that, you could. So, my question is, if I did a P.O. box, um, you guys could, if you wanted to, not that you have to, send me things and then I could do a mail vlog um, and share all of the gifts and stuff that y'all have sent me, which would be so fun because I would love to get like different things from different places and hear from everybody. I don't know. I just think it's cool. I've seen a lot of people do it before and my light is going to turn green, arrow green, arrow green. Go. Alrighty, so I go. went into Home Goods really quick and I picked up a white like wreath it's really pretty um, something that I could actually put on my front door because the one on my front door is looking a little on the puny side it looks sad so um, until I can like tweak all that and make that one look better which I will do I'm gonna hang it I'll probably hang that one in the house on the other side of the door unless I tweak it really really nicely and it works perfectly and it looks better on the front door um, if not, then I will just hang the other one on my door in the kitchen, on the red door. Because I think it would look so pretty with the white, um, which I'll show you guys later. You can't see it right now. Because it's in the trunk. So, yeah. And so right now I'm just kind of waiting. I'm going to go back into work here shortly. And then I'm going to, I think we're having Ruby Tuesdays delivered to us today. So I'm going to probably eat that. Whatever they bring from Ruby Tuesdays, that's what I'm going to eat. Um, and then what else did I get? Oh, and I got like a little saucer thing for like $3.99 that says um, naughty or nice or naughty and nice. Naughty or nice. Um, so I thought that would be kind of cute to set some stuff on. I am just, I don't need anything else, so I should probably stop before I get a little crazy and whatever. But nonetheless, so yeah, I'm just going to go back to my office and that's what I'm going to do. And get the Ruby Tuesdays, the Ruby Tuesdays lunch that they're bringing us. So that's it i will check back in with you guys probably later on either on my way home or before patients start coming back in i don't know yet all i know is i just want to keep you guys entertained if we're going to do vlog a days and we have to do this together guys you know we have to you know be on the same page you might get bored with what i have to show or what i have to say during the day but if y'all want me to do vlog a days then this is what you're gonna get so I'll check back with you guys later. How high Bye. is gas by your guys' house? It's $7.89 here. Actually, it really isn't. This is a new gas station that they're just building, and I think that they are just now put, putting the signs up. But $7.89? What? That's crazy. So, yeah, we won't be getting gas there ever. So, this is what I do on my lunch. Is I eat my lunch, which I already did. They didn't bring the food like they were supposed to, so that sucked. Um, so this is what I usually do, is I watch videos. And right now I'm watching Jen from Pretty Neat Living. And she's just doing her update on her pregnancy, which is so cute. 
And then right here is my water bottle that I told you guys about earlier, about my challenge. So I'm on number two right now. And then I'm just going to finish the rest of this because I poured this inside here. And it didn't fill it all the way up. So I'm just going to finish this and then have that <clears throat> and drink that. So that'll be number two. So I have to finish three more of those plus eight ounces. Um, but Brian and I are going to Mexican tonight, and we always drink a lot of water when we go out to dinner. We don't ever drink any soda or anything, so, um, but anyway, so that's that. I just want to share with you guys what my lunch hour consists of. Yay, so exciting. Hello, friends. Welcome to my after work. It's five o'clock, or it's five o'clock somewhere, but it's five o'clock here for sure. Because I am now heading home. And I'm done. I've already drank my second yellow um, sippy cup. Sippy cup. My yellow water bottle full of water. I have three more to go. But I already had like, I want to say maybe four ounces from my other bottle. Because I had to pour it in the, I explained that earlier. I don't need to re-explain it again. If you guys missed it, just rewind and go back. Anywho, so I just like checked my Facebook page again and I was like, oh my God, so many more people were like, yes, do vlog a days. Yes, do vlog a days. So guess what? I'm gonna do vlog a days. But I am seriously like gonna tell you like right now, I cannot guarantee how long each video is going to be. I cannot guarantee the content in these videos. I cannot guarantee that they're going to be up at nine o'clock every morning. It might be 10 o'clock in the morning. It might be nine o'clock in the morning. I cannot guarantee what time these are going to be up because obviously I work and so I don't know. But other than that, I will have one up every single day and I don't know how I'm going to do the Disney trip yet regarding vlogging. I know I'm going to vlog at Disney. That's that's a total given. But as far as getting a video up for like the next day, I don't know how well that's going to work out because I know that we're going to be like midnight-ish with Disney and like then by the time I get back to the room, it's going to be like one or whatever. But if I plan it carefully, the days that I'm not sure I will have a video up, I will try my best to have a video up. It may not be, it may be like a pre-recorded type of video. Um, so like I said, we shall see. We shall see how it all goes because I know that's gonna be kind of difficult to do, but I will definitely do my best. But I'm super excited about the Disney vlogs because, and if I'm not like looking at the camera, it's because I'm driving. And I probably shouldn't be vlogging and driving at the same time. So maybe I'll just go and I will talk with you guys in a little while because I'm gonna, on my way home, Brian and I are gonna change clothes or I'm gonna change clothes and we're gonna go out to dinner tonight. So I will take you guys along. So welcome to vlog a day. Did I just see anything? So I made it home, yay! And I changed clothes and it's like 55 degrees outside, finally cold enough to, thank you, sir. He held the door open. Oh look, Brian, they're hiring. You need a job? Hello. Hi. No, I am. <laughs> You can be though. I will do say hi. <laughs> so you must know what this is for. You too. Vlogging. <laughs> I wanted to share with you guys what the front of our house looks like. We have like one of those lights that flicker on the house. And I think they're like supposed to be snowflakes, but I can't really see snowflakes. I just see a lot of flickering lights. But I also wanted to let you know that we put um, red and green and red and green and red and green lights outside of the house. And then um, Brian hung up red and green bulbs out there on the front porch. And then this is what the front porch looks like all lit up. Which it looks like I might have some lights out on my tree. But oh well, that's just the way it's going to have to be for now. But that's what that is. 
there we go and that is going to be it for my vlog for today i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to give this a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and share this with a friend who you think might like it as well and i will see you guys tomorrow bye guys